A local grandfather is recovering after being pummeled by a group of suspects. They tried to rob him in South L.A. yesterday. CBS 2's Candace Crone spoke to the man who is now scared to walk in his own neighborhood. I just, I just think it's terrible that they do that to an elderly, you know, because they can defend themselves. Monica Ortiz Garcia couldn't hold back tears as she described seeing her 73 year old father after he was brutally attacked in South LA yesterday afternoon. Jose Ortiz told us he was walking near Manchester and Figueroa when three young men tried to rob him, then repeatedly punched and kicked him before taking off. He suffered a busted eye, broken nose, and several other bruises. In Spanish, he described feeling helpless and wishing the violence would end. Le he was just hoping that they wouldn't keep hitting on him, that they will stop. Ortiz was attacked here just minutes after he got off the bus. The suspects got away empty handed as he normally chains his wallet to his pants and then sticks it in his pocket. His phone was secured as well. Despite being violently beaten, he was able to reach his daughter on his cell phone and tell her to call for help. I say, I don't know, for nothing, they almost Pretty much killed him. It could have been worse. Ortiz, who's retired, is recovering at home, but now paranoid about walking in his own neighborhood, especially since no arrests have been made. He wants justice, partly so the suspects won't attack another innocent victim. He's saying for them to not keep doing that to people, especially to older people, because you're not taking into consideration what the consequences are going to be after, you know. Reporting in South LA, Candace Crone, CBS 2 News.